every successful story has that moment. I knew a person who knew a person. And you know what? We all have a guy for something. And uh, that's how success works. Well, you know, it's actually uh, one third of how success happens. Think of it as the who you know. Well, here are three things to build your, your network of people and increase your circle of influence. Do you have what it takes to make the right left to you? If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel for videos to educate, entertain, and enlighten. Circle of Five is based on three major areas. Friends, family, and associates. Your job is to figure out the five most influential people within each category. Think clearly on what five friends and family do you hang out on a regular basis. And also, the five associates you hang out with the most while working together. Associates are people you see while you work within your field or have a survival job. However, if you hang out with these people outside of work, they are technically considered friends. Why don't you figure out the five for each category? Think about how influential they are within their own lives. To figure out how they are influential in their lives, you simply look at what they have done for the last three years. If in the last three years they have improved their living situation, be it accomplished more and grew in their job, or they are extremely happy and they are always somebody that is inspiring, motivating, and encouraging of your life and their own, that is a good sign that they are influential. If they're unhappy, they're still at the same position in their job, they haven't really elevated in their field of interest, or anything that they do, this would assume that they are uninfluential in their life. It's best to think of those terms of influential in their own life versus uninfluential in their own life because the five people you hang out with the most in your life become the world you live within. Successful actors hang out with successful actors. Successful musicians hang out with successful musicians. If you want to be a millionaire, hang out with millionaires you will start absorbing their knowledge, wisdom, and understanding of that lifestyle. Once you know your five friends, five family, and five associates, start trying to figure out their five most influential friends. And over time, you want to try to connect the dots so that you could eventually expand your network of people. Volunteer your time often. You need to get involved with your community. Give them, you know, your time, especially with your field of interest. This kind of activity gives you a better chance to build your influence within relationships. More importantly, to build influential relationships within your field of interest. The one thing we can give to somebody else is the greatest resource we have, which is time. It costs us nothing to give it, but the reward and return is great because spending your time wisely within your field of interest will generate a huge ROI. This is also another way you can potentially get yourself a mentor within your field of interest. Since you are already near and involved within your field of interest while volunteering your time, mentors will see this and it'll be easier for you to access their wisdom and knowledge and for them to see your value and quality and therefore give you back some of their time. Because you must remember, it is not about you. It is about them. Give them your time and you will get a lot in return. The knowledge on how the business works alone is priceless real time schooling. Go to events, free events, paid events, friends and family events, whatever. Go to events. You have to go out and be around people. If anything, specifically events within your field of interest, also, the reason we support our friends and family is because the more we give into those relationships and build the value of it, the more likely they're going to want to help you when you come to them and ask for it. The idea is that all people are important. They are humans. Therefore, they have value because like you, they need help too. And showing them your support by being at their event is more about them than it is about you. And that's okay because it is about them. It's not about you. And so what if they're not going to your events right away in return? 
they will come around eventually. If you put your time into them, they will come there. Because the goal is by giving your time to them, they will eventually go from being associates to friends and eventually be considered family. Thank you for watching uh, this video and supporting these traveling adventures of a resilient entertainer. Please a like, a comment, and share the video along with subscribing for future content. Have questions? Let me know in the comments below. I love questions. And when sharing, remember to at Thomas J. Beleza and I will see it. Therefore, I will be able to share your content in return. And as always, don't work too hard, but be productive. And remember to work with people so you can grow with people and eventually rise with people. Do you have what it takes to make a right left here? Do you? Do you, punk? And do you have what it takes to make a right left here? Or do you? This is my dance when I think of you. Oh, I think I'm, I think I sprained something. No? I definitely sprained something. I can't stop. This is very painful. I'm just saying, we're going to need to cut. Oh dear.